Now before we get started, note you will need to finish the Fremic Trials quest. Although technically you can be on Waterbirth Island without it, you will need to do the quest anyway to wear the armor. Now you'll need standard combat gear, preferably utilizing the combat triangle, but this is mostly if you're a lower level, but it can easily be done with a single combat style. Now before we collect the armor, let's collect Dagonoth hides. Gear up and head to Waterbirth Island by speaking to Jarvlod in the Relica Dock. And head into the cave along the only path. Now the Dagonoths right as you enter drop the aforementioned Dagonoth hides. And you'll need these for the helm, legs and chest plates of all combat styles. So collect these at your own leisure. Info on screen now. Now heading east you'll find three pathways. Northern being the rock crabs. This is where you get the melee gear. The middle with the Walasakis. The mage gear. And lastly the southern path with the Dagonauts. This is where you get the range gear. But note. The southern Dagonauts are not the same as the one you killed previously for the hides. So don't kill those expecting armor pieces. Kill those only for hides. So let's start collecting armor parts. Now the process is technically the same for all the armors. So I'll mostly just explain one of them. But it will show you the safe spots to make collecting the armor pieces for all of them much easier. So let's work with the melee gear. As mentioned before, this is the raw crab path. Now the monster in question will drop the gloves and boots, but only parts for the rest of the armor. Info on screen now. If you wish to stay the raw crabs safer, head farther into the path where you'll only be attacked by maybe one or two. So just like the raw crabs, gloves, boots, and parts. Info on screen now. The safer area will be to continue along the path, head down, only one floor, where you'll encounter only three. Now you'll keep killing them in rotation as they spawn, one by one, so it's definitely a lot safer. Once a monster has lost its aggression, it just climb down, then climb back up. For the range safe spot, head further along the path, info on screen now. And hug this wall. You'll still bump into the stray Dagonoth here and there, but it's definitely a lot safer versus the main path. Once you've collected all the parts and hides you need, head to Relica. For the melee armor, speak to Skullgrim in the armor shop. For the mage armor, speak to Peer the Seer. And lastly, for the range armor, speak to Sigil, the Huntsman, in the town entrance. 